Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we are doing another video on the channel where I will be talking about the Essentials mod. And this video is related to the video on the hardcore Minecraft series that I'm going to be posting on my channel as I made a hardcore world with some friends and we played around and stuff and it was really cool. Like this mod would give us the ability to make a free hardcore Minecraft world. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that in this video right here. But first, make sure to subscribe and to check out that trailer at least. Check out the trailer for that series because it is an amazing series that we're gonna be uploading. All right, so let's get into the process of downloading the Essentials mod and all that stuff. So first off, I just wanna say right now that if you have the Forge or Fabric or whatever, you can install the launcher for the Forge or the Fabric. I actually installed the, the Forge for the previous video on the Essentials mod, which was how on, on the cosmetics part of the you know, Essentials mod. But the way that I'm going to show you is the simplest way of downloading it. And sometimes the simplest way does not work. So if you do have issues with it, go look online for how to download Forge and how to download Fabric mods and play on them. And usually it's the same for Essentials because it's just like any other mod. So there is that. But let's get right into the tutorial on how to download Curse Forge and use Curse Forge or the Essential Souls mod. The first thing I need to do is to download the Curse Forge launcher, of course. So you hit the download here. There's also more download options for Mac and Linux right here. And unfortunately, if you are using Linux, I don't think it's going to work for, for Minecraft. I think that's only for World of Warcraft. But there is a Mac download, so there's that. Uh, let's download for Windows. And so once you get the installer, you have to double click on the installer and install it and and once you see this page right here the curse forge has been installed successfully glhf that is you know an indication that the curse forge launcher is installed and all that stuff so you might see this page right here if you see this page then you have to click on minecraft of course go to create custom profile now there are many versions of the Essentials mod, there is a 1.19.4 version of it, so let's type in Essentials as the name. Alright, so I clicked on the profile that I just created, and so you should see something like this. So let's go to the Add More Content, and in here type Essential, and this is it right here, the Essential mod. Hit install. This is for 1.19.4, 1 1.19.2, 1.18, 1.16, 1.12.2 Forge, and 1.8.9 Forge. So those are the versions that essentials are for. There is nothing below 1.8, and yeah, that's very important to keep in mind. By the way, that, that there's nothing below 1.8. So if you're using 1.7.10 or lower, you're going to have to find some other version of, or like some some other way of making a server for um minecraft and this works for both fabric and forge of course so fabric 1.16 1 18 and 1.19 are there and so simply put we just hit play on this thing hit continue it's going to launch up a minecraft launcher of course hit play play again all right guys so you should see something similar to this right here obviously your character will be on this page right here but let's go over to social first. In this tab, go ahead and start adding in your friends. To add in your friend, you hit the plus tab here, add a friend, and type in their Minecraft username. Now, if their Minecraft username does not work, have them type your username, and if there's something wrong with either of your usernames, then that means that you just need to really focus on like uh, typing it verbatim, 100%, one by one, However you else you want to say it, make sure to type it perfectly because especially if they have like any underscores or anything regarding that. While it does work, you have to make sure you type it in perfectly. I do have a lot of complaints from this section usually, but make sure to add them perfectly one by one. Maybe capitalize the correct letters, add in the numbers and all that stuff. Get it perfectly. All right. And with that said, the frame request will show up in the middle. Uh, the blocked players will show up here, and the friends that you already have will be showed up right, like right here. So yeah. Now let's host a world. 
uh, first you have to create a world of course so let's go into single player so in the create new world section game mode has to be hardcore of course so create new world and so we're gonna create a hardcore minecraft world all right so once you're in the hardcore minecraft world hit escape go to invites survival creative adventures spectator that depends on what you want them to be in when they spawn in obviously you probably want them to be on survival difficulty hard cheats if you want cheats enabled sure i guess next invite your friends on the friends list here hit done and that is it there's also the world host setting so if you obviously have a set set of you know rules you want to put in uh let the thing know that you want to put it in from here and that is it so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you like the video like video, you want to subscribe button subscribe and remember to be the top you must be the top i'll see you guys in the next video take care and good bye